Hello, in this mini tutorial I'm going to teach you how to make a game of Jack rotate due to player input or automatically. Okay, so let's start by selecting our game object and then going to add component. Let's type in rotate and then hit new script. Then select create and add. Finally, let's double click our script and open up in Visual Studio. So in Visual Studio, let's start off by removing the start function and creating a public float called rotate speed. Then in update, let's type transform dot rotate zero rotate speed multiplied by time dot delta time so that the movement is frame rate independent and then zero. Let's head back into Unity and check it out. So let's select the game object that we attach the script to and give it a rotate speed. I'll type in 50 for now and then let's hit play. And our game object should now be rotating. If we want it to rotate in the opposite direction, just give it a negative value. Okay, so let's head back to Visual Studio for the last time and give a user a way to control which way the object rotates. Let's create a public boolean called auto rotate. Then in update, if auto rotate is true, then the code we've written before will be performed. But if it is not true, else, then transform dot rotate zero, then input dot get axis horizontal which will return us a value depending on whether the user is pressing left or right multiplied by rotate speed and multiplied again by time dot delta time then zero back in unity let's hit play and if we press the d key or the right arrow key our object should rotate in the clockwise direction when we press the a key or the left arrow key, our object should rotate anti-clockwise. When we hit auto-rotate, our object will start rotating with no need for any player input. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next mini tutorial.